Good day, Taurus, and welcome to my channel. This is your weekly reading for August 19th to the 25th. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well, and I hope this reading resonates with you. The universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Six of Spades, Jack of Clubs, Three of Spades, and, ooh, there you go, the Three of Clubs. Yeah, so your general energy is the Three of Clubs. This card trumps all the other cards, so no matter what pops up, this one trumps them. Uh, so... Uh, this is absolute success, right? This is like everything on the board, whatever it is, you're going to be successful at. Uh, this is fame and fortune. You know, this is this is a great card. Um, now, when I say fame and fortune, do I mean that you're going to win an Oscar? I mean, no. I mean, unless you're up for an Oscar, then yeah, you're probably going to win an Oscar. Uh, what this means is that people are just going to see you as a star. They're going to have stars in their eyes when they look at you. You know, they're going to see you as this. Uh, they're going to see you as a rock star and a movie star. You know, they're going to see you as somebody that should win awards. You know, so they're going to really gravitate towards you and hang on you. You know, and and follow you and whatnot uh fortune does that mean you're going to win the lottery i mean it could but what's the likelihood of that not not very not very good right because I'm, I'm i'm saying this to a, a, a an assortment of people out there right so not everybody's gonna sit there and win the damn lottery but uh what it does mean is that you're going to be financially stable this week okay you're not going to have any problems with finances now could you end up getting more money sure yeah you could definitely end up getting more money than you usually do uh during this week but for the most part it means finance like you're financially secure you're fortunate uh so i mean just with this card this week should go pretty good regardless of what the other cards are which i'm not seeing too bad of cards here uh, the beginning of the week is the Six of Spades, uh, time to travel. So either you are traveling at the beginning of the week or you need to travel uh, at the beginning of the week. And by traveling, you're going to get peace of mind. It's going to bring you peace of mind and it's going to help you move on with life and move forward to newer, better things in your life. Okay, so if you aren't traveling, then I suggest you do some traveling. And traveling can be as far as America to Japan or from your house to the local museum as long as you're traveling and doing something that you have or you know going somewhere and doing something that you haven't done before that's going to bring you peace of mind and uh, a nuance to your life uh in the middle of the week you have the jack of clubs take the risk yeah take the risk go on that trip you know uh go traveling do whatever it is uh but this also means you know uh any ideas or projects or anything that you're wanting to do is a go you just gotta take the risk you gotta think and focus and take the risk now here's the problem here there's a player at hand that does not want you to take this risk okay uh they they probably see that this is going to be good for you and they don't want that they don't want that for you they don't want the best for you so there is a player at hand uh that you need to uh figure out what you're going to do about them now to identify this player uh, i would definitely say um, if you want to travel or you are going to travel, this person would try to talk you out of it somehow. And they do it in a way where they would make you think that you came up with the idea, right? So that's, it's tricky. And uh, this is also somebody that's going to stop you from any ideas or anything like that that you want to do. But they're going to do it in a way where it's going to be hard to tell that they are the player. At the end of the week, you have the three of spades, miscommunication. So yeah, there's going to be miscommunication with somebody, and it's going to lead to a fight and a breakup. And this miscommunication is coming from betrayal. This person's betraying you in some sort of way. This person can be the player, but it also can not be the player. Uh, so they might not be the same person, but either way... 
uh, somebody is betraying you, and uh, it's going to be a, it's going to lead to a fight that leads to a breakup, and it's going to start with miscommunication, right? But that miscommunication is probably going to be your clue that there's betrayal going on. Now, at first, you're not going to see this as a blessing, but it is a blessing. The cards say it's time for a change. It's time for this relationship to end. Uh, there's probably been this person's probably betrayed you more than what you know, you know. Um, so yeah, it's just time. It's time to move on from this person and move on with your life. Let's go ahead and see what the tarot cards have to say. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? All right, you got the uh, King of Cups. Uh, now the King of Cups. He is a he's a strong one. He doesn't even have to speak in order to command. All right, he can just do it with a look, right? And you need to be like him uh, and and command your life uh, without even speaking. You know, like say this player is like, oh, don't do this, oh, don't do that, or this, that, or the other. Don't even say anything. Just take the trip. Don't even say anything. Just take the risk. You know, do what you want to do. Be bold. Be assertive. You know, to yourself. And uh, yeah, don't even, don't even uh, uh, entertain uh, this player whatsoever. Okay, you just do what you want to do. You know, they say whatever they want to say, uh, but you go ahead and just do what you want to do. All right, don't even, don't even entertain them. Just uh, let them say what the hell they want to say, and you move on and do what you're gonna do. All right. So that's how you need to be this week. Is like that. You kind of need that be that way. I think with this person that you're gonna be fighting with, stop the fighting. You know, just stop the fighting. This person, they're no good for you. You know, just let them go and do whatever the hell they're gonna do. You know, just remove them. You know, and let them go because it is a blessing. This breakup is a blessing. Uh, and that's all there is to it. And, well, here's the greatest thing, though. You got the three of clubs, and that trumps all. So you will be successful. You will you will do travel. You know, you will get that peace of mind. You won't listen to this player. You'll, you'll not even speak. You'll just let them talk whatever their talk, all right? You will, you know, eventually just stop fighting and, and remove this person and move on with your life. You will do that because of the because of the three of clubs so there you go i hope this resonated i hope it helped in some way if it did hit that like button and if you would please comment share and subscribe i hope to see you back here next week and until then stay safe stay mindful and stay healthy